Yemen Tunsi, the master baker at the Stute Bakery Cafe in Armory Square, has been baking and creating pastries for 25 years. He's only 37, which means he started when he was just 12 years old. That first gig in a neighborhood bakery in France began as a punishment, a summer job meant to tame a mischievous kid. Who would do such a thing to a young boy? My dad, the boss. <laughs> but for Tunsi, that so-called punishment became a great love and a career. Five years old, you go to work, you get your breakfast, you know, you learn things, you can try everything. You know, sometimes you can hide, you know, behind the door and eat, you know, stuff, so it's good. <laughs> I mean, who doesn't want that? As a teen, he enrolled in baking and pastry schools in France, and by his early 20s, he was baking all over Europe. And then I said, okay, so I think I'm going to become a pastry chef. He came to the United States in 2015, and last year he saw an online ad for a bakery in Syracuse. He sent in a short reply. Are you looking for a baker? Stoop Kitchen and cafe bakery owner Eric Alderman was intrigued. He tracked down Tunsi on Instagram and was wowed by what he saw. Artisan baguettes, bagels, croissants, tarts, and more. Tunsi visited Syracuse last year, before the stoop opened in October, and liked what he found in our city. He also saw the chance to build his own bakery from the ground up. Today, that basement bakery is Tunsi's domain. He starts his day at about 10 p.m. and works through the night, mixing and shaping the dough, waiting for the proofing and rising, and finally putting the loaves into the oven. Yeah, that's nice. Mm. Tunsi worries over each loaf or pastry that leaves the stoop basement. Each tart, each raspberry, must be perfect before going up the stairs. So we want it to look all nice and good, you know, and attractive. And, and so it's a, big, uh, yeah, it's a big job, so you have to control everything, you know, every single piece which comes here. When I came here first time, when I came to visit Eric, and it was nothing. So now when you see all that, it's, it's kind of, yeah, nice uh, satisfaction. You know? 